So, um, <laughs> amongst other things, <laughs> you know, so with the barrage of thoughts that have been going through my brain about, you know, the whole 9-11 Twin Towers situation that I woke up to a few very important memories of and, you know, the Xenu, <clears throat> uh, and the, um, <laughs> the Xenu, oh man, this is so fucking nuts, this is so fucking nuts, this is nuts, and, uh, so then there is the other thing that before I, uh, move completely on, it's like, I, you know, it, it was reminded by, as I was watching, um, Ariana's, uh, couple videos, and, um, she's singing on stage, now, at the same time, down where my friend lived is where I bumped into Dylan Roof, and around about the same time that that happened, and Dylan Roof was not, and I'll say this, and I'll say this again, say this again, Dylan Roof was not surrounded by anybody of his skin color. And at the same time, Ariana is on stage in New York, crying over a song, wearing a dress that should have been her wedding dress for the wedding that we should have fucking had. You have no idea what's going through my head right now because, oh, and then I'm thinking, well, who was she dating at the time? Oh, that's right. P. Diddy's fucking kid. Big Sean. Which it's not even labeled anymore that he's the kid of fucking, you know, or... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It, it, it's so it's so fucked up. The, the cover-up is absolutely fucking insane. It's absolutely insane. It really is. That, that's, that's fucking nuts. That's fucking nuts. That's why, that's why I'm saying it's like, you know something? It's like, when I... And, and, and none of that triggered any of the memories. But as I was watching, like, some other stupid videos on YouTube, like Abandoned Places... I came across, oh, look at that, P. Diddy's mansion that was abandoned out on freaking the east end of Long Island. And I'm like, oh, you've got to be fucking joking me. Now, this was a couple weeks ago. And I was like, do I even... But then all the other shit started to barrage. The thoughts in my head started to barrage from that. And just that got lost over the past couple weeks in... Should I even put that in a video and not... You know, I mean, it's definitely important. There's no doubt that it's definitely important. So, um... You know, and uh, as far as it seems, the place is still abandoned. Why is it abandoned, Jesus? Because, you see... <sighs> there was bodies found on the property... That's why. <laughs> there was bodies found on the property. But I'm pretty sure it was due to certain legal red tape. <laughs> oh, man. Is that kind of like yellow tape saying caution? No, it's... It's like legal red tape. It's like fucking, you know, it's like, what the fuck? It's like, yeah. So now I'm just wondering to my fucking self at that point. It's like, wow. Yeah. Yeah, no. So that's that's what I want to say about that. Oh, why am I saying that? Because who, 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 who obviously, who obviously brought the attention to the bodies that were on P. Diddy's property, but little old me, right, so it's, it's like, cheers to me, it's fucking great, so, I've been trying to as as reminding myself of this over the past couple of weeks. And then, dude, it's like, well, I'll put that in the next video. It's like, and then it's just like, yeah, man, it's like, you know what? And then all this other shit. That's why, that's why it's like, it's like, I, yo, man. Church of Scientology, which I don't even want to talk about. And it's like, it, the, the minute I titled the video 
to the church. Dude, that's what I'm saying. It's like, to the minute I titled the video... There was a problem uploading the videos. <coughs> Which then I, I showed... The problem of, like, 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 I had nothing to do with the fact that fucking, that's why I took the screenshot video when I posted the screenshot video of that. And then talking to a supposed, not even a, I can't, it's, I haven't even seen this person. It's like, and then in the middle of talking to them about, like, a problem with the church, not even mentioning fucking, I don't even think I mentioned Scientology, all of a sudden, some shit started happening with the phone, and then I'm thinking to myself, it's like, that's amongst other things, there was, uh, some pictures of, um, and I'm like, oh, man, you gotta be kidding me, man, you gotta be fucking kidding me, man, I have no problem, I had no problem with the Church of Scientology, okay? L. Ron Hubbard liked me because I liked science, and they knew it. Ahead of me being able to like science. Like, like in other words, like, I was fascinated with the world around me as a kid. You know, and that's, that's the whole point. It's like, you want to know something? It's like... You know, people can be their own destructive force, and you could sit there and even claim that about me, because at this point, I don't want to even fucking clean this fucking place that not only was I kidnapped when I was four, but they tried to fucking kill me when I was 17, and then this was the only fucking option that I had to move into when I it came to, oh, you have to move, and it's like, well, why do I have to move? It's like, in two months, I can move anywhere else in the fucking United States. And fucking, and, and, and fucking, this is the only fucking place that would take my dog. And I had to move. And then all of a sudden probation ended. And the minute probation ended, and the minute the fucking order of protection that the uh, cannibal Mr. Martinez, Emilio Martinez, took out on me. A cannibal took a fucking order of protection out against me. This is fucking insane. This is fucking insane. I, 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 you have no idea. And then I'm just, I'm just like, wow, man. And then I'm thinking, so when, once all that came to an end, the minute that all came to an end, that's when the fucking electric bill bullshit started. That's when fucking my bills went fucking skyrocketing into fucking no man's land. And I'm sitting there, that's why I just showed you the fucking bills. I just showed you the fucking, I just showed the fucking bills of the entire past almost two years. Well, actually, what, a year? Over a year, over a year worth of fucking bills and they have not come even they 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 have they are still they still have not come close to the fucking bills that I received when I first fucking got off probation after moving into here that's crazy that's fucking crazy that's fucking crazy and you want to know something else and then and then wow Wow. 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 It was after I bumped into Dylan Roof like three months, two or three, about three months before he became Dylan Roof, the mass murderer. That's when, that's when shit, I, I mean, like, I was already woken up to some shit, but it was when I came back from that, going down to see my friend, bumping into fucking Dylan Roof before I even realized who the fuck Dylan Roof was. To me, it was just the fucking drunk kid standing next to me, surrounded by nobody of his skin color. At a fucking random bar? Wow. Wow. You know what? And with all that said, 
it's like it's like that's when I started putting things together. But then, and I and I put this together beforehand. I I, I said fucking you know it's it's really fucking interesting. Right around that same fucking time period. Right around that same fucking time period. That's when fucking that's when Ariana is in New York City. Crying on stage. Singing a song that I was already told was meant. Wow, man. Wow, man. Wow, man. That's why, that's why, that's why I'm saying to myself, it's like, and I kept saying, it's like, you know, and then, and then not to even mention, I didn't even mention, I didn't even remember the fucking mansion situation. Didn't even remember the mansion situation. Not the Manson. The mansion situation. Until fucking... I remembered the medallion. I remembered the good memory. It's always... It's always the fucking good memory. What the fuck is wrong with me? What the fuck is wrong with me? The medallion. Because Puffy knew about the fucking medallion. To fucking, to, 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 to run the fucking Hell's Angels. That was left to me. I'm not even a Hell's Angel, right? But to, you know what I'm saying? It's like P. Diddy knew about the fucking medal. The medallion. The freaking medallion. That's what I remember. I remembered fucking P. Diddy standing on my fucking lawn. Mace, sitting in the fucking chair. Tell me I'm wrong, motherfuckers. And I don't mean that in a... F- you know what? Never mind. Never fucking mind. You know what? You know what? And all this shit, and then it's like... It's like... It's like... It's like... Wow. You know? It's just like fucking wow. It's like fucking wow. Like nobody ever fucking stops. Nobody ever fucking... Wow, man. Calm my nerve juice. You know, and that's why it's it's real interesting that when a certain man that is now gone, and, and even then, it's like over the past couple of weeks, I've bumped into very interesting individuals, and I'm saying to myself... It's like, wow, it's like, you know something? It's like, we'll see. I, you know what? I don't even want to say. You know what? I just want my fucking money and get the fuck away from everybody at this point. I was warned. I, that's what I'm saying. That's why I brought up the fucking church Scientology because I did something good for that church. Not, 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 not when I was little. What all I did at that point was meet L. Ron Hubbard, and L. Ron Hubbard wanted me to help lead his church. He knew at that point that I wasn't against science. It never says that in the Bible. It doesn't say that Jesus is completely against science. He says, do not meddle with magic. Do not mess with magic. Why? Because if you do not know what the fuck you're doing, you end up building something that blows up your entire fucking planet. That's why. That's why. Because you dumb motherfuckers have done that a lot. A lot. I've met heads of the pagans. I've met fucking witch doctors. I've met fucking top level fucking people. I've met fucking Buddhist monks. I don't mean that in the... (laughs) That is so bad. That is so bad, Jesus. Do not, do not do this. <laughs> Anthony. Do not say fucking monks, okay? No, the, I've met Buddhist monks. I have met, I have met, and I mean, they came to me. Sash is enthralled. Enthralled, right? Wrapped in, right? Yeah, wrapped in. You know, wow, 
it's like wow it's like wow I just I just blanked because it's just like bam you know what I'm saying I forget what I was uh, was going down uh, after summing up the situation of um, as far as my memory serves me right there was only the three times of actually being like there for a purpose of the Church of Scientology that is uh, point one the meat you know to, to 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 know like this is this is something that. See, there was things that people brought up, but the but actually going down there the first time, the commitment that I signed to find out what the problem was, because they knew that there was a problem. They 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 were aware that the problem was that when certain things were being done to people for for uh, speaking bad. About the church or or misteachings of the of the church. That that these people that these people were threats to the church and no offense, but that's the same. That's why church and state are two separate entities. There is a downplay of Catholic teachings. There is a downplay of all these th- Catholic. Christian at Christianity, Catholic teachings, some of which are in the right and some of which are in the wrong. But to only what? Verify and glorify other religions? No, 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 no. Don't get it mistwisted when I say that the Bible is conjoined with other scriptures from other religions because those stories happen to those people too. Whatever God that those people wrote their Bible with, those events were some of the same events that people were going through in Christianity and Catholic uh, Catholic societies that were not so much uh, written down at that point. The coming of Jesus, Jesus, all the things that are being predicted by the Bible. The Catholic Bible, the World Wide Web of Conspiracy, the Internet, Black Mirror. And when I say that I have met some demons with more moral standings than some of the people that are in the church, old spirits, new spirits, what's the difference? Old spirits and new spirits, big difference. The older you get, the more manipulative you can become. Hurt innocence? Hurt innocence? Oh. Oh. I'm sorry. Have 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 we have we have we not read the Bible? They used to take newborns and they used to place them in a field to die their form of abortion at the time cultivation of farm and land was not so much a a well to do thing and even with the 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 the, the the evolution of all of that, of of farming and of cultivation and all of this, then then some people who didn't believe in anything anyway, they just kept going. They just kept going and more consuming and more consuming. And this is some of the teachings of the Church of Scientology. 
Do they get it right? At this point, I can sit there and say, I don't think so. <laughs> and on the same hand, on the same hand, I can say that some people, they definitely don't get it right, but they don't give a fuck. Now, I've mentioned everything from a lovely little conversation I had a long time ago with a girl who, even that, was more potent in my mind than my own memories of myself growing up. I was just as good as her. People knew it, and, and if I wasn't as good as, I was even possibly better than her. Because I know what happened with the story I just said. The things that my mind were able to do as a child were incredible. And people did do their best to keep me safe from what they knew was the problem that they were already trying to work on. As I started to grow, that problem became more and more evident. Because they started to really realize at that point, and these are people that knew about the spirituality. These are the people who were priests of whatever religion they were. That there was a problem with the, with the other side. Mimics. And I don't mean mimics like... I mean, you know, yes, I do mean it, and yes, I don't mean it when I say people who mimic. No, no, no. These are spirits that mimic. What does it say in the Bible? What does it say about dabbling with witchcraft or magic? A person claiming to be of the side that can speak to the dead. Why does it say... That Jesus will come back not to just judge the living, but to judge the dead? Does that make any sense unless you apply what it is that I am telling you right now? So upset with everything. I met the son. I met, I met the one who took over the church of Scientology. He was afraid of me. I met Zenu. Zenu, oh man, or should I say... Hmm? Hmm? You know, not so much Xenu, but yes and no. When it comes to the face that they put to the word Xenu. You know, you know, scientists, they built this machine. And they built the machine when they came finally to the government. They said, we fucked up. We built this fucking machine that can do these things. We built it because we thought we were talking to angels. And they were giving us instructions on how to build this machine. Sure as hell. Sure as shit. Sure as heaven above and hell below. They built this thing. And when the machine proved that it was able to do things. They freaked. Because certain things that were coming through were very, very... Uh, too real to them. They went to the government. They tried. 
you know, this story, I could just continue this story. I've already said this story. So there's no, there's no point in saying that the things that mankind can build, they can do wonderful things. Man can do very wonderful things, and yet they can build things that can destroy themselves. Evil destroys itself. The other side, the spirit realm, should know at this point I am not their enemy. Now, I know I'm jumping from here to there, but let me bring back the field where they used to bring children, newborns, to, and leave them there to die. Now, people want to sit there, and over the course of my lifetime, they want to sit there and try to throw in my face when I wasn't even going around saying, saying, hey, look, I'm, I'm the Lord Jesus Christ. I am the Son of God. No, I, I didn't. I didn't. But other people knew. And they would throw in my face these things. And you know something? It's like I was a kid trying to just be a kid. In the society of my age range. Now I am disgusted. Even why trying to old understand the old. Why trying to see the new. But that's an important thing. There are things that are listed in the Bible that are very, very outdated, but they'll never be outdated because that was the time period that those things written in the Bible needed to happen. You can take one of those stories that sounds so wicked and so evil. And if you apply it to new understandings of life, that is when the merge of understanding that that was written for that time period. But there are parts of the Bible that will never change. There are truths that will never change. And yet, because of certain things that have taken place on our planet, in our existence, that we are not even aware of, and m most of us are not in aware of, in awareness of, in awareness of high priests know, and even them, they didn't all have the answers. One of the things that they were aware of, but they were not able to understand well was the mimicking of the spirit realm. The mimicking of angels, the mimicking of certain demons, especially from the demon side. Or the so-called demons. I, 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 don't, I don't mind using that word because it's so often used to describe what is the fallen. And yet, the fallen were angels at one time. Lucifer, Satan, all of these things, are they that far gone? The Bible says don't pray for the devil. The devil will never ever be whole in the eyes of the Lord. And yet, the devil has free passage into heaven to talk to God whenever he wants to. You know, you know, people, even with free will, I've already went over the whole, if there's only so many doors in a room, and three of the doors are blocked, on the other side of the door, there's a blockage, there, there is no, there is, there is no, there is no plausible way that you can get out of that room from those doors. And there's only one. So then where's your choice? But that's still free will. You can attempt whatever you want. If the tools are there and the, and, and the willpower is there, maybe that will get you through. The harder paths in life. What does it say in the Bible? It says, walk, walk not the path of 
most traveled or the easiest path. Walk the harder routes. Because within those routes, you might find the knowledge that you are intended to find. So if you have the will or if you have the strength to go through those other doors, but some people do not have that. Because people are built differently. But do not hate each other. Do not down each other because you can lift 2,000 pounds and this kid can only lift 100. Spirits. I've said some things about spirits and the body and... There is so much I want to clarify, but I won't in this video. Basically, all of the things that I've talked about when it came down to when the first spirit, the first spirit that was in a dinosaur's body was put into the body of God. And same when it came to the spirits of the forest being put into the vessels, God's vessels, the bodies of the children of God. Every living creature has some sort of spirit. Other spirits are not the way that you... That's why they say that no dogs go to heaven. Moving on. There was something very important. I was just uh, about to go into and now my mind has just relaxed to the point of blanking for a moment because all of this stuff that I am saying is so heavy and so real the topic I wanted to talk about is something that I'm questioning in my head that is very, very, uh, it has something to do with one of my cousins, a situation that I've already brought up just recently. The friend that should have recognized the situation, there, there, there is a very interesting part of 